demo video of the Countess counting the plastic um, strips. I think they're plastic. Um, what I've found is counting end on is the best way because we've got a nice clean edge. So I put a pile in front of the machine. You have to train it in the first place and give it a name so you can see I've got it transit 2 as a name. I press the count button. In a few seconds you've got a count of 34. I take one off. 33. Put one back on again. 34. So what you have is a menu. In here you've then got a list of all the things we've counted previously. So once you've trained it you can just go back to what you've trained before. So I had one earlier which I make called Transit. If I go to that one now it will zero the count and that one's also already set up and we're getting 34. So this one's actually put in there twice and 33. It counts very fast. You just literally see the light where the camera has taken its picture, giving us a count of 34. If you see here, this is actually what the camera is seeing, or the light and dark between each sheet. So the fact you've got this black sticker on here gives us the enough room to be able to see the sheets. I'm sure it'll also be alright for your fiberboard because that again has a very good edge definition. Um, so when I found when I was trying to count the long edges, then the way because it's split as it comes off of your machine um, wasn't so accurate. I can spin the stack around and count the other end and still get 34. One away, 33.